Hello, so welcome to the new series in which I will be showing you uh, cool hacks, tricks and free, mostly free tools for learning languages, uh, foreign languages even, even more quickly. So in this video I'm gonna talk about Google Translate and how to use it even more efficiently than probably most of you do it. So all you have to do is to install a cool Google Translate shortcuts extension for, for Google Chrome. So I assume that you use Chrome when on desktop and well, this video is dedicated for people who use computer when learning languages and uh, yeah, okay, so the I just installed this cool extension, it's installed and let's see what's the difference between Google Translate without extension and with extension. I have to reload it and uh, here it is. Yeah, so let's say that I want to invite my Russian friend to go to the movies with me uh, tonight. So all I have to do is to write this sentence and here is the translation. Now if I want to listen to how to pronounce it correctly, normally I would just click on this button, but with this extension I don't have to do it. I just press Ctrl L. Здравствуйте, вы хотите пойти со мной в кино в кино сегодня вечером? Yeah, that's good enough, yeah, I can know how to pronounce it, that's cool. And you can see that the difference between Google Translate without extension and with extension is that I have these small numbers and letters, which mean um, that I can basically click, uh, press Control plus this number or letter to uh, use, this use a given functionality. So for example, if I want to change the language, instead of clicking on this uh, arrow, I can just press Control 8 and if I want to change the target language I can click, I can press Control 9 let's say I want to translate it into Spanish because I have a Spanish friend whom I also want to invite uh, to go to the movies with me tonight so again I can just, I can copy it with uh, Control C that's it and, whoops, and I can paste it super uh, easily. This uh, Chrome extension is absolutely amazing. If you uh, use Google Translate on a daily basis, I would highly recommend it to you. Um, it's actually quite painful to use it at the beginning because, well, you have to learn the shortcuts and it's not uh, straightforward. You, like, you will have to memorize it and you're, you will have to develop this muscle memory. But once you have it, you'll be saving very precious minutes of your every daily language learning routine. So uh, yeah, let's install it and uh, see you in the next video. More tricks are coming soon. So